Hmm. I didn't think I'd be uh, filled up all the way with hit points. But at least I uh, show off what I've got. Yeah, I decided to uh, put the Devil Strike rune on the hero instead of uh, just leaving him with um, his regular fire rune because uh, I plan on using uh, his level 4 charge with the rune of punishment and uh, I think I'll, I'll probably just uh, leave the other ones because uh, they're not going to do me any good, so... Um, was kind of hoping for um, putting on a uh, double strike rune with a uh, um, yeah there, but uh, a while so I might have also uh, just gone with um, double strike rune for snow instead of its water rune, but I want to leave it around just in case I needed uh, a little extra healing with him. Um, and I also did the same thing with Ted, so, um, I guess if, uh, Snow had an extra space, like, on his head, um, I probably would have gone with, like, a mid or something, but, and I wanted everybody to have a Sunbeam rune, because, uh, in case I am put to sleep, um, I will have something to actually heal me up, so. My equipment um, showed that off, but um, do it again just in case. So, um, I wish I would have uh, been able to get the Pirate King bracers and the Pirate King boots, but you know, oh well. So, um, the guard ring and the lucky ring. Um, those are just two regular things that uh, you can actually build down in the, uh, I think it's uh, the, the fifth floor um, with the mermaid, so, um, and the wood amulet, um, that is the thing when I went in and talked to uh, Rede, um, Rita, and Noah at the very end. I got into a little cutscene and, uh, was able to get that from them, so. Got, um, <coughs> two power rings, um, those things, uh, you can build, um, give up darkness, um, I got here in a final area, um, and the ogre stuff, um, I was able to build with, um, um, oh, um, I was able to build uh, when it was uh, sharpening weapons and stuff, so. Um, I might leave an annotation about uh, what you need to, to, to have to build those things in a, where you can actually find them, like uh, which enemies you're gonna beat and stuff, so. Um, I I think with the uh, ogre things, uh, that is one that we had to have like a um, good gold or something. So, um, hero stuff. Uh, uh, I think it was uh, the hero helmet um, I picked up here in the uh, last area. Um, Shore Armor, um, that's an Ilya Island, um, Hero Shield, um, 
that is something that uh, we have a limited time to get um, when we go into um, uh, Roswell after we liberate it. So, um, and I wasn't able to get the Herald Boots because uh, that was that stupid rat counting game. So, um, the Speed Ring and the Lucky Ring are just things that we can build with the mermaids. Um, and the Magic Caster, um, I just picked up here in the last section, so. Uh, the ninja stuff, um, uh, I was able to build all those things with the, uh, I'm, I'm thinking, uh, they were good cloths, um, I think that's basically what I had to have for that, so, um, again, uh, if there's something else, then I'll leave an annotation about what I have to get. Um, the Speed and the Lucky Rings, um, uh, I just, uh, built those things with the mermaids, um, I could have built a water amulet down there with them too, um, but I, I just, uh, switched the water amulet that I got, uh, from way earlier in the game off a hero and put it on his head, so... Um, okay, stay just here, um, and not much I could really do about it, changing my status, so. Uh, formation, leave it the same, uh, same thing with the options here, so. Um, If I get killed, um, when I go into the final boss, um, I just won't show it off, I will, uh, just leave it off here, and, uh, of course, if I actually win the game, um, then, of course, I'll leave it in, so, um, yeah, here we go. So, you've returned, O oh Rune of Punishment. The Rune's memories, among them, did you see a child? like to hold the rune of punishment once more and play with those sweet memories. <laughs> Long ago, that rune chose us. It didn't choose you. This country must grow stronger. The islands, your lives, you exist only to fulfill our destiny, as does the rune. When it comes to a battle of wills, I have no doubt that mine shall prevail against yours.
Okay, this guy can be really cheap. The reason I have so many jitter clocks is I'm sure that uh, some of my guys will die. And the reason I have so many salads is because I want to cure stages ailments. He will put your guys to sleep a lot. And of course, once he does that, then. Uh, you're really vulnerable, that's why I put the uh, sun the sunbeam more up on and so but you can uh, defeat him really easily if uh, I think everybody has to be at like level 70 or whatever and uh, you have to have like power rings on all three of uh, um your places for accessories, but that will just take way too long, I think. So, but you know, hey, if you're having difficulty with this, then uh, you know, you might as well do that. So, I'm gonna take out the uh, seeds of light. Your main objective will be uh, the giant tray, but you want to take out the seeds first. Okay, above the giant tree, um, there will be a couple of, uh, you know, different colored orbs that will uh, appear above it. Um, that will uh, dictate what he does for the next attack. Um, if it's uh, green, he usually does a Thetis ailment, and uh, if he does a white, it's a really powerful attack. Um, if your guys are fast enough, um, then definitely defend against that, so. Because uh, it, it can uh, just wipe you all out.
really don't care about those things down there, so... Ooh, that was easy. Really easy. cut off from this body. Now, you do not wish to return to it again? It's dangerous here! Hurry up and run if you don't want to die! Or it turned off my controller, so. Three cooler soldiers, and luckily for us, there's no time limit. You would think that uh, because this place is basically going to explode, um, they would want to get out of here as soon as possible, too, and wouldn't bother fighting us, but. Two elite captains and two elite soldiers. I know not yet. 